Hellpoint is a new action RPG from developers Cradle Games and published by Tiny Build. The game falls under the Souls-like genre, typically defined by a grim narrative, horrendous enemies, and methodical combat. This is our first 3D Souls-like game on the Mac, which makes it notable. Most Souls-like games are set in some kind of medieval or fantasy setting. Hellpoint goes in the opposite direction with a sci-fi setting in space. Aboard the derelict space station Irid Novo, you awake, a created entity ordered to do the mysterious author's bidding. Nothing ever goes well on abandoned ships in deep space, and Hellpoint is no exception. A catastrophic incident known as the Merge has blended multiple realities, unleashing horrifying enemies and twisted creations across the station. Your goal is to find out the series of unholy events that led to this disaster. As you play, the ship revolves around a dark black hole in real time, triggering various dynamic events such as unique bosses and hordes. The first thing you will notice in Hellpoint is the bleak atmosphere and sharp visuals. Both are terrific, and the devs nailed the gloomy and creepy setting. While the station is often dark and colorless, more vibrant sections do open up later on. Some are beautiful, and you'll want to just admire the scenery. I enjoyed watching the black hole through windows, especially when a giant creature would fly by outside. The bulk of your time in Hellpoint will be spent in combat. True to the Souls-like genre, fights are weighty and methodical, and even a lowly enemy can pose a threat. You have access to light and heavy attacks, a block or offhand ability, and a quick roll dodge, which you will always be using. Combat is often about understanding the variety of attack patterns each foe possesses and beating them up at their weak points. Melee is king here, but you still get some firearms later and magical items to mix up combat with more ranged abilities. Things start off a little slow, but pick up quickly after the first boss is defeated. You'll have access to more weapons, gear, and levels to play around with. The game has a clever death mechanic. As per the genre, you also drop all your current experience when you die. However, this can be regained by finding your corpse. Yet in Hellpoint, you also have to fight a ghostly spawn of yourself, which uses whatever gear you had equipped on death. If you happen to die in a room full of enemies, you'd also have to defeat your ghost. This added an interesting wrinkle to the combat scenarios. After the atmospheric elements, the enemies are another impressive area. Many foes are just plain unsettling, indeed the stuff of cosmic nightmares. While basic zombie-like creatures won't give you too much trouble, the bosses are epic and often grotesque. If you are struggling alone, feel free to call on a friend for co-op, either locally or online. You each get your own loot and experience so that the entire game can be easily played together. The game strongly recommends a controller, but I found it smoothly played on a keyboard and mouse. The controls are straightforward and can be remapped as you like if needed. Conveniently, you can switch between six different weapons or items in each of your hands with a hotkey. For all of the game's high points, I have to mention some flaws. The camera can be a little clunky in tight spaces or with the enemy lock-on feature. It's not game-breaking, but still pesky. While I commend the devs for mixing up the game with platforming, the controls can be a little fiddly, leading you to jump to your death instead. The game also has some bugs and sometimes feels unpolished. Lastly, while the story's point is to be mysterious, I felt the narrative was too sparse with too much information withheld from the player over its 20 or so hour runtime. The world is intriguing right away, and I wish the devs gave me more to go on than just combat hooks. Hellpoint has good performance for the Mac version. The game features Metal API support and runs on a heavily modified Unity engine. On a 2019 5K iMac, it runs at a smooth 60fps on ultra settings and 1440p resolution. Keep in mind, this video was externally recorded in 1080p 60fps, so you won't notice the higher resolution. On a 2019 13-inch MacBook Pro, it ran at a stable 30fps with low-medium settings and 720p resolution. High-end gaming on a 13-inch MacBook Pro always has its limitations, but Cradle Games have shown that it can be done to some success. We also compared performance between the Windows 10 and macOS version, and as you can see, it's pretty much identical. Hellpoint is supported on the following Mac models. Pause the video now to see if your Mac model is supported. Hellpoint is available on Steam, with a Mac version coming soon to the Epic Games Store. Hellpoint is a fun game in an exciting genre. Some notable weak areas hold it back from greatness, but as a first Souls-like entry for Mac, it's not bad at all. More than anything, Souls-like games appeal to players who don't mind punishing gameplay and dying often. 
If the sci-fi setting and brutal gameplay style appeal to you, then Hellpoint will be enjoyable. If this particular style isn't up your alley, then Hellpoint is best avoided. If you enjoyed the video, please drop a like, as it tells YouTube that we're doing a good job. If you're new to the channel, we post many videos on Mac gaming. Consider subscribing and turning on notifications to stay updated.